what is happening guys welcome back to another reaction we uh on patreon we just checked out the uh, stay week uh skizzy vlog the stay week 24 in milan as well as the jam music video behind the scenes and i also checked out the mc countdown performance of jam which was a lot of fun if you're interested in checking that out consider checking uh out the link to patreon we also checked out last week the full performance to lola palooza in chicago which was a lot of fun uh and uh yeah the jam music video ended up being arguably my favorite music video by stray kids ever like it's kind of a maybe it's a bit of a stretch because stray kids have some insanely uh well-produced music videos and especially after chick chick boom which was like so high in its scale but at the same time i feel like the editing in that music video really uh made that mv at jam you know fuck sorry that was cringe but uh yeah it's it's if not the best it's definitely one of my top five favorite music videos by stray kids it was just dope the whole the horror vibes as well i've seen some comments of people being a little bit disappointed that i didn't pick up on some of the references to like you know chucky or resident evil or some other stuff honestly even though I do like Resident Evil, I know Chucky, obviously, but I'm not like the biggest horror uh, fan out there. So I, I I got horror vibes. I got some, maybe even there was like mention of like Ghostbusters, which I thought was kind of cool. The, the one thing that I was happy about was Han with the Switch Blade, the Switch Blade, with the Switch Blade, uh, which reminded me of Sweeney Todd. That the Sweeney Todd. Sweeney? Sweeney? Sweeney Todd. Uh, that was like the one of the most memorable things uh for me i absolutely uh freaking love that so uh apologies if i missed some stuff but i also didn't really feel the greatest during that reaction uh but we're checking out the dance practice video very very excited because the choreo is probably one of their most complex choreos especially like that chorus so i'm excited to check out the uh dance practice so without further ado let's get into it This is so fucking pure with me now. Damn. Let's go. Pirate Chan hits different. I know he has probably like an eye infection or some kind of a injury that I feel is 
unfortunately very prominent within k-pop probably because of like makeup and stuff like that probably like touches your eyes or like some i, I guess inf infections are kind of like uh are, are just the thing that is inev inevitable uh but it really fits them so you know you know uh I love this chorus so much, but like the choreo is so fucking fire. Like they literally become like audio visualizers. Like every single nuke and cranny of that audio, every little part gets emphasized either, either with their upper body or their lower body. Everything just, it, 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 it's, it's insane. This part is just... Ugh. Working on some magic spells. Damn. <laughs> nice. <laughs> is like, yeah, that's what happened. I'm also kind of like blown away by, you know, IN's extreme makeover with like the hair. Like he went from like the lightest of hair colors to like the dark. Like he went from like that bright yellow to like fucking black. And not that black is an extreme color, but when you go from one, ex from like the complete opposite, it, it, it is extreme. And he pulls it off. It always blows my mind how much idols are able to pull off like the craziest fucking hair colors or hairstyles and everything else again not that hair black hair is extreme but like the the contrast that he had before is uh the score is so much fun but at the same time this is like a fucking crossfit workout like this is this has got to be like some of the most insane choreos that they have ever done it's so complex. It, 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 I can only imagine how hard it is. And like to imagine that they would probably add it to like their future life shows and whatnot. It just blows my mind that they're, they, that they even would be able to do it. Cause like performing so many songs in one go, so many different choreographies and not messing it up is like another level of fucking amazing. Um, there's a vibe with Bang Chen with with the eye patch again i know that it's probably like an eye infection so i hope that he's not like uh in too much pain but it just fits him so well honestly and it's just it, he gives off like a bit of a you know anime character vibes or like a pirate kind of vibes and i really really like that i think there's something with sung min too because he has like a, a bit of a band-aid over his cheek so not sure what, what that is if it's a cut or another infection or something like that but hope everybody is obviously doing well the choreo is fucking awesome i think this is my favorite song from the entire album now like it's it's really really crazy i absolutely love this one and uh you know the music video itself was again in my opinion top three top five music videos by stray kids ever and you know whoever edited that video i hope that he he got a raise for that one because if not that's that's fucking lunacy uh and it's diabolical <laughs> on jyp's part but uh yeah this was awesome i hope you guys enjoyed this reaction if you did make sure to like this video subscribe to the channel if you're new check out the rest of my stray kids reactions in this playlist and if you want so much more check out the patreon where we have their survival show we have their appearance on kingdom kingdom week we have all of the episodes of skizzy code there's a bunch of live performances and so much more there's a full list in the pinned post on patreon it will lead you to a spreadsheet document click on stray kids and the whole 
section will be revealed to you and all the reactions that we have on there. So if you see something on there that you find intriguing, consider subscribing and I'll catch you all in the next one. Be well and safe wherever you are and have a wonderful rest of the week. See ya.